Hello everyone, I'm Argama Witch, and look, I'm in Valheim! <laughs> Yay! So I have recently made a post over on my Twitter uh, showing this off, and I've had many people ask me uh, on Twitter and off about how to get uh, their character in, their VRM, their Vroid character in Valheim. So I'm gonna kind of like give you a little bit of a walkthrough. Uh, the first thing you need to know is that you're going to need to get this um, Bethlen X pack, whatever this is. You need to get this. I use the manual download. You just click it and it'll download onto your desktop. And then you're also going to need to get um, this file from the uh, from their GitHub. I'll leave links down in the descriptions. Uh, but just click on the zip file and download it. And once you get those two files, uh, we're ready to go. Uh, you're going to want to open up the files. You don't necessarily need to extract them, but uh, we're going to go over to Valheim and we're going to go um, uh, browse local files. And something similar to this will pop up. You'll notice I have more files than you, but that's because I've already added my files in here. And um, yes, I'm sorry I didn't want to. I didn't want to delete them, but that's. So from here, what you're going to want to do is to, uh, well, you don't have to extract it per se, but at least open the zip file and you're going to see uh, these items here, right? Uh, so what you're going to want to do is open up the uh, this particular one up here, the top one, and grab all of these files here in this uh, Beplin X pack of Valheim. Just grab it and just drop it over into here. All right, I'm just, I'm going to skip this for now because they're already in there. Everything I need is already in here, so I'm just showing this for your sake. But drag and drop that over there. If it wants to replace anything, just say yes. Okay? Okay. Uh, the next thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to open the um, Valheim uh, VRM zip file, which is the second file we got. It's going to look like this. And, and the one you have might be different than the one I have, but... For the most part. Um, so one of the things you're going to want to do is create a new folder. A new folder. And you're going to name it Valheim, uh, Valheim VRM. So I don't need to do this because I have it right here. Valheim VRM. Just like this. Alright. Um, and then let's come over to here. First we're going to go into the, the BepNX. And I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing this wrong. but Alright, and click on Plugins. Right now, over in this one, we have right here is the plugins. We're gonna click that, and we're just gonna drag it, and then just drop it in. And you can just do yes replace. It doesn't matter for me if it replaces. Um, the other one just took a little longer. Now we're gonna we're gonna back out a little bit, and you're going to see this um, data, the Valheim data. Click, and you're going to go up to manage. Click, and then over here, the second one, you have data managed. Click, and you grab all this and you drag it in here and you hit replace. Now, if you ever decide to update, um, like let's say, cause right now it's 1.5, but let's say like 0.6 or two comes out, whatever. All you have to do is copy these over and just hit yes to replace. Okay, okay. All right, and now you can come back over to your Valheim folder. You have this VRM. Mine's gonna, mine's gonna show stuff in it, but don't worry. Yours is gonna be empty. Well, let's just, Yours is going to kind of look more like this without the new folder in it, right? And you're going to get this player settings and you're going to drop that in there. Now what you're going to do is you're going to um, grab your character and mine is of course our gamma. So we're just going to come over here and we're just going to drop it here. Uh, my character name in Valheim is our gamma. So it's got to be whatever the character name is in the game. And then here, where it says settings underscore player, you're gonna change the second part to uh, your name in Valheim. And at that point, you're all set. You can launch it and it should show up. Um, so, ba 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 ba, ba 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 ba. Also, do not send me a friend request on Steam. I ignore everyone I don't actually know. Okay. Okay. And don't harass my friends on Steam either. 
fact, I'll blur them out. Alright, and you should see over here that you have, like, uh, the Bethlehem plugin working. You start game. See, our gamma start. And, uh, start. And we should be in the game. Also, I recommend that you make a backup of your save file just in case. Always make a backup of your save file just in case. And, uh, here I am. Ta-ta! Uh, I'm in my prince outfit. Looking grand. Looking snazzy. You love it? I love it. Now, keep in mind, others aren't gonna see you in this outfit. They're not gonna see- they're gonna see you as, uh, you saw yourself in the, um, opening here. You see how you see yourself here? That's what they're gonna see you as. The only way to change it is if they also have the plugin, if they also have all the mods in the plugin, and they have a copy of your VRM. So, although I can't really show you now, because I don't have friends on, I can show you an example after, but... So by doing this, um... I have Argama, J-Man, and, and Melly, and I have like these files down here for it too. Argama, J-Man, and Melly. And these are basically... We play together um, in my server. So when they start up too, I will be able to see them, and I can show you some examples here of just a couple screenshots I took with them showing up on my screen. It didn't show up on their screen, they would have to put in the same shit on theirs. But that's it! I just wanted to show you. Um, yeah. Uh, if you have any questions, you can leave them down below. I probably won't be able to answer them, but I'll do my best. And uh, I will uh, talk to you guys uh, later. Alright, bye.